organization is about, and as part of what the Mad as Hell Doctors Road Tour is about, to create that wave of energy, that momentum that's going to come into Washington and create change. And we know the forces of the opposition, right? I mean, we are in a country where we have investor-owned corporations running our health care, and they're making a very handsome profit doing that, and they do not want to give that up. And we have to make a choice as a society. What do we want for our people? Do we want to continue to kowtow to them, to do partial reforms? Or are we going to stand up and know, recognize there's opposition, and do what we need to do? Are we ready to do that? Yes, yes I'm ready to do that, too. And that's why we stood up to Senator Baucus. But it's just the beginning. We still have to continue to build our movement, to educate ourselves, and to exert our power. And so we're on our way to Washington, D.C., and we're going to march to the White House, and we're going to ask the President to meet with us as physicians and to start having a real conversation. The insurance companies and the pharmaceutical companies never should have been at the table to begin with. They are not the health care providers. They kept calling them the stakeholders, but we know who the stakeholders are. The stakeholders are the patients. The stakeholders are the nurses and the, all the allied health professionals and the physicians who work with patients every day. We're the ones who can create a health system that works and it delivers better health. You know, the sad thing is, and what keeps me going in this, in this campaign or movement or whatever you want to call it, is that we can do it. We already have enough money. We're spending enough money in this country right now to provide quality health care to everybody. We have hospitals. We have doctors. We have nurses. We need more. But we can get there if we have a system. We have everything we need except the political will. And so we need you to help us create that political will. And I hope that each of you will go out and educate your neighbors, your family, continue to work, push hard on your legislators, because we're going to keep this going until we get there. It's the only thing that we can do. Too many people are dying and suffering, and we're going to end that, right? So what do we want? Single payer, right? And when do we want it? Right. Thank you so much for being here today.